Hi, welcome in our plastic home. We live with, with four. Shall I show you around? The safe home is built completely out of wooden walls inside and on the outside it's made of recycling plastic because if you can see here this is the uh, the inside so everything is bio based with wood and on the outside we have the plastic and that's uh, a, a good idea because plastic doesn't uh, react with sun with water with the elements so you don't have maintenance or what, whatever and inside it's wood well, with my company, we already save plastics professionally for over 30 years and we put it in all kinds of products. But my wife said, I guess it was three years ago, we have to make uh, a house uh, out of your waste plastics. Because people understand the house, but they don't understand benches or uh, all kinds of other products. Because a house has a soul. And it's really important to make build a plastic house. So uh, the reason why we build this house is because we want to save th those kind of plastics. And because the, the plastic doesn't have a really good image. Everybody says plastic, no, 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 no plastics. But the thing is, at the moment, everything is incinerated. And that's also not a good story. So b first build something out of it that is useful, for instance, for a, ha a house. And then you can say later, okay, let's incinerate it then or whatever. So that's the reason why we build a plastic house. Yeah, so the, the family company Save Plastics already exists for over 30 years. And we save the plastics that is otherwise be incinerated. And we call it the, the household waste plastics. And it's in the mix. Every color mixed, uh, all kinds of textures. Uh, normally, no company can do something with it, but we can use those materials to make planks, poles, all kinds of products, and also for the housing. And the sole business of Safe Plastics is to save plastics into useful products. So we have multiple uh, businesses around us that are selling end products, but all with the, the materials from Safe Plastics. Hi there, thank you for watching. My name is Wim, I'm the content creator of these mindful building and living videos and I do hope that you enjoy this content. If you like these kind of videos, do hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell because then you'll be notified when new content comes online and I hope this will inspire you in your own mindful building and living dream. See you around! So everybody knows we have a really big problem with plastic waste. On the other hand, some materials like a sheet metal, uh, aluminum, wood is really difficult to get at the moment and uh, perhaps also in the future. So uh, on, the, on one hand we have a lot of waste plastics and on the other hand we have a demand for, for products. So we want to use those recycled plastics as a new building material and uh, to do so you first have to um, know that we should build ecologically. We, we should stop with cement, with concrete, with uh, materials that are imported out of China or Indonesia or whatever. We have to do it locally. So if there's locally waste, why not use it for ecologically housing? So this is the sleep room of one of my boys. So here you can see the ceiling is really high and that's really important in a small room. And it's cool here. Yeah, it's the north side of the house, so the sun is not here. So for instance, in this room we have recycled curtains made of recycling plastic, but also the chairs are made of recycling plastics. How cool is that? So here we have the bathroom. small small unit but really effective 
and also on the walls we used recycled tiles, aqua tiles. So here we have our heat exchanger. It exchanges heat from inside with cold new air from outside. So it's, uh, it's better for the balance. And we designed this machinery so we can go off grid in the future when we have our solar panels. Uh, we now live one and a half years in the plastic house and it's really nice. So the ceilings are high, everywhere is the lighting really nice. Uh, it's really quiet because of the triple glass. Uh, everything is domotic, um, electric. Um, we live with, with four people and so I have two big sons. So that was the question. How, is it is going to be crowded in a small space? But it isn't. Everybody has its own room. So it's really nice and comfortable. So this is our kitchen made of recycled wood. And as you can see, it's all modular. And here we have our bedroom, but that's private. So the plastic house is designed uh, by an architect, especially for the plastic house, because you uh, don't want to feel like it's small, uh, but it should be small because of the footprint. It's better to, to live smaller. Everywhere you have uh, windows so you can look around. And uh, another advantage of um, uh, building with small units, you can put extra elements or extra units on it. So you can live in a plastic house with two, three or four, four units. And uh, also, because it's a unit, you can transport it. So we leave no trace. It's almost like a tiny house, but then XL. So on the top of the unit, you can see a socket. And there, a crane can lift it on the truck. And then you can move your house. So within a few months, we're going to move somewhere. So here you can see the structure of the plastic house. It's made of units. And uh, in this case, there are three units. And the middle one is uh, mirrored so they're exactly the same in height but they're mirrored and you can see now it's it looks nice i would recommend living in a plastic house uh, not because it's made of plastic but it's because it's smaller the size is 75 uh, square uh, meter and we come from a really big house and we always said we're not going smaller but you should because it's really easy cleaning. You don't have stuff anymore. It's uh, you can everything you have you can see. It's uh, it's it yeah. It's it's really mindful. Thank you for watching. Hit the notification bell so you never miss an episode. Questions or remarks, post them in the comments down below. If you like our video, just click the subscribe button so you never miss an episode thank you for watching